for this you will need the .dat, I have the PL00.dat and the three tools from my pack, that extractor, mode 2 and MD to SMD 2.0. And so let's start with that extractor. Pretty simple, just just extract or just drag and drop in here. Firstly, let's run the DAT extractor, and we just need to drag and drop in here. Enter, and it's done. It's this is the extracted file from this DAT. When we enter it, there is all of the files that were that existed in that .dt or attention belongs to the md md is the godhand model format for this one we will need md to smd 2.0 so i just drag in here and i will open and I'll just drag and drop in here. Great. Now we have one final step. Once we extract it, we will have the MD folder, which this is the actual model and armature. And we will also have the this file dot bones. Uh, this this file is very important if you want to use mod MO2 if you don't want to use MO2 you can just delete this file but if you want to import animations for this model for the sake of god man don't, don't delete this don't delete this just just save this save this for later the program, the program had crashed the recording program. Well, now these are. This is the moat. Uh, okay. In short, this is the folder that contains all of the character animations, all of them. So, in order to make this work, we'll have to go into the extracted model. Get this dot bones file and move it to the mode folder among all of these files. Now you will just copy the path and will hit enter. Now it shows how many files are remaining, but this would take a little too long to finish, so I will just interrupt the interrupt the program right now and we have already one two three uh, six six animations converted now we just need to import it again and boom once you play it huh it's perfect well not exactly you see the uh, the legs there are some models that this will happen. Why? Because back in the day, Godhand used inverse kinematics, which means some uh, some movements didn't translate it correctly. All right. So how do I fix this? Well, you you need to edit the armature. Hit edit. Select the feet bones, the toe bones. I'm not. I'm not sure how, how which one's more correct, feet or toes. Then you unparent them like this. Clear parent. All right. Once you have done it, it will uh, resemble more the stance, but it's not quite right. Is it? It isn't. To fix this, definitely, you will grab 
these two bones and parent on the root of the model like this wait uh like this keep offset keep offset and there we go yeah well uh, uh, of course there's this also this is pretty uh easy to fix but uh, make sure you're doing this after you imported every animation you want because if you try to import more after you do this the animations will break I'm not sure why this is a, a deal with the, the SMD I just made an SMD because it's the most moddable of them first of all connect the joints only only these ones only the ones on the knees the uh, these ones you don't need to connect only this ones and then you move a little bit forward like this it will not affect too much so don't worry go in bone constraints add constraint inverse kinematics select the target and the bone the bone should be this fit over here, so we will copy the bone name, which is uh, which is 21, and we'll be back on the inverse kinematic, and we will use it, set the chain link to 2, and we're done. It's beautiful, oh my god. Same thing with this one. There are some problems. For example, right here. Oh, actually, it looks pretty okay. <laughs> Porque eu me assustei. Você entrou do nada no quarto. And that's how you use the tools I have made for God Hand. There are some minor problems. Uh, but this is, this is all about the inverse kinematics. For example, in this this animation over here, you can see it it uh it disconnects a lot and even on this part right here you see it's it's so uncanny but uh, I, I, there's nothing much I can do about it really I, can, I can't do anything about it it's just how it is but hey it works almost perfectly which is something for a game that came on to it um, to 2007 and never had a model and animation extractor I guess it's pretty good already for a start I hope to see more God Hand 2's in the future but for now I will, uh, will continue doing more stuff I hope the animations are pretty interesting and pretty great. Oh my god, look at these movements. Ah, this is my favorite. Oh my god, the energy he, the energy he, he just hmm <laughs> from the kick up. Ha! Oh my god, so great. It's just a kick, but it's very pretty good. Well. This is all again if you try to import any animation after you have made all of these things on the model, the animation will break. So make sure you have imported all animations you want before doing this. I hope you liked. A quick tip is that um, I didn't find a way to integrate normal maps in here so to fix this you will need to well first I'm going to retire the animation 
you will go to the mesh in edit mode mesh and merge by distance and recalculate outside and it will look pretty pretty good it will not look so polygonal anymore just merge and recalculate outside and it looks pretty good it looks pretty fabulous well except for the eye but that's all right i hope you enjoyed the tutorial leave me the give me a like please i am recording this on 3 a.m i'm i'm so fucking tired i want to sleep please don't you think i deserve a like on doing god hand twos please please look at his face well that's all for today see you another day